So, behind me is Dennis's reptile house. And in there is not only Dennis, but all his reptile pets. And we're gonna learn about him now. Come on. That's, that's, oh, look at that pattern. Yeah, the pattern's really beautiful. Something. Wow. Yeah, this is a coastal corporate python. They originate in Australia. Mm. And then uh, also some of the, the uh, 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 surrounding areas around Australia they come from. Now, these are the ones that have the notorious gene, the carpet pythons. How's the what? The gene, you know, the, the, that makes them sort of shaky and uh, out of balance. Uh, is that the carpet pythons? No, the ball pythons. There, there's a lot of them do that, and, and it has to do with the breeding, hmm. not so much the breed itself. Like this is this this here doesn't have any other morphs in it, basically. Oh, okay. It's just a, uh, so it, it wouldn't have that. Yeah. Okay. Bindi. So what's his name? Bindi. Bindi. Yeah, it's a female. Bindi is from the uh, Australian Zoo, the daughter of the crocodile hunt, uh, the hunter. Oh, you know, really? Bindi. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So Steve, named her Steve, after. Um... Named her after. Yes. Yes. Yeah, Steve. Uh, I can't think of. Anyway, we named her after his daughter. Mm -hmm. Bindi. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Mm -hmm make my own little hides. What is that? It's a it's actually a bucket that holds the the um, little bags of shock for pools. Oh okay. I just cut them down, cut a little thing in it, hit the edges with a torch to make it smooth. Mm -hmm. And uh, all the hides you buy are square. Mm -hmm. I've never seen a snake ball up in a square <laughs> circle. Okay. Yep. When they bought, they just like that in a round circle. Mm -hmm. And uh, so that it just makes them very comfortable, easy to clean. I just make my own. Pretty cool. The the blue tape I put on when I when I know they're in shed just tells me that. The snake needs to be sprayed every day. Oh, okay. It makes it help some shed. He'll be shedding. He'll be shedding in a couple of days because his eyes aren't milky anymore. Mm -hmm. So probably the, the, tomorrow or the next day when I spray him. What kind of snake is this? This is a, 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 a red rat snake. Mm, cool. It's just a common old red rat snake. This, this, uh, this one here um, I adopted from a family where the, the, the man that owned it passed away. Mm. And they turned it into Petco and Petco called me and I went and, I went and, and uh, got it. And I was going to find a home for him but it was so thin because the family hadn't been feeding it. And uh, once I put weight on him, he was so tame and docile, I used him for education. Mm. Almost everything I have, I use for education. Yeah, I think you, you brought him down to Ruskin that, that last year we were down there. For the Wonders of Wildlife. What's that? The Wonders of Wildlife, didn't you bring him? Yeah. Yeah, I thought so. Yeah. I'll be bringing him again too whenever they get to. If you look in there, they I screw different kinds of things together and make hides out of them. He'll lay up here sometimes. Um, they all have water bowls and they all have heat, belly heat. Oh, is there, is there a heater under there? Every cage has belly. That's cool. Here's the Oh, I see, yeah. That's the probe that measures the heat and the thermostat. They're all right here. And 
I can I can move move them around and and have like these two here because they're gravid. I have them on one thermostat to keep them warmer than the rest of them. Mm -hmm. And then the one that's breeding, then they have less heat. So I can just constantly unplug and replug and and uh, do whatever I need to do with the heat. But this is a, a, a Brooks King Snake or a South Florida King Snake. Somewhere in oh there it is. He's a full grown adult. His name is Cayenne. It's a male. He's a native. Just native. Mm -hmm. Yep. Native to South, pretty much to South Florida. There's like seven different varieties of king snakes in Florida. But there's a lot of different patterns and hey, hey. some are some are uh, some are, are more you know darker, some are lighter. But they're pretty much all the same. Mm -hmm. It'd be nice. It's another educational night. People like this, his uh, color and his beauty. Right? Anytime you got something interesting to people like that, they come to you, they'll talk to you and ask you questions about reptiles. So you use these just to draw their attention. Mm -hmm. Then you go from there with it. He's a... Uh, he has to have a one of these over his water bowl because he wants to flip his water bowl over, uh -huh. over all the time. So I put the hole in here. He has to go in here or in here to drink. But um, this way here he doesn't flip the water bowl over. The every snake's got their little mm. bowl for Here's the king, is, a, is my new Florida king snake. What they used to look like in this area when you could find them. That's a, I mean, that's a real local native. This is a real Florida corn snake, uh, <laughs> king snake. A real Florida king snake. Mm. Like I said, you can look up king snake and you'll see all the different variations, but there's really only about seven actual species. Mm -hmm. He's eight months old. His name is Sky King. <laughs> I don't know how many people will remember Sky King. Sky King was a show when I was growing up, Cowboys and Indians. Mm -hmm. Sky King owned a ranch and he flew a plane and he was called, the show was called Sky King. Mm -hmm. So when I got him, I couldn't come up with a name and I thought one of my favorite shows was Sky King. So that's how Sky King come about. If you Google Sky King, you'll you'll actually see the airplane and the and the guys that were in the show. Mm -hmm. It's pretty cool. And I keep all my cages locked. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the door to the shed is locked. So none of the snakes will escape unless I forget to close the door. Mm -hmm. Imagine you check that out every time you, before you leave, huh? Yep, I, I go stand at the door and I turn around and look back and I look for, <laughs> make sure everything is locked up. <laughs>